goodness, I'm not sure we're live yet. So I apologize if I am and I'm not realizing it. But good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, my name is Ginger. I'm a priest with the Celtic Christian Church. It's good to be with you for Coffee Break Prayer. In case you've been a regular and were wondering what happened last week, I was just under the weather with a sinus infection. So kind of drained. But I'm feeling a lot better now. So I'm very, very, very grateful. Anyway, welcome to Coffee Break Prayer, and it's Monday, so on Monday, it's a good time to just take a deep breath and um, remember what it feels like just to be in our own skin is the bottom line. And we do encounter God there. It sounds like, oh, that's mindfulness, it's not religious. Well, it is spiritual because... We believe that God is Emmanuel, God with us, right here, right now. So today, um, in our breath exercise, let's also pray for the gift of flow. And what I mean by that is this morning is, the, is, to, is that which counteracts languishing, right? According to this great article I saw in the New York Times today, I'll put the link in the comment section, and not the comments, the... Uh, whatever the description anyway languishing is not when you're depressed it's just when you're not yourself it's hard to focus like if someone says to you hey how you doing and your inclination is meh no 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 that's called languishing and it's something that is um according to this article it's like if mental health is a spectrum from woohoo flourishing to depression, then languishing is somewhere in the middle. So you're just not yourself. And after a year of um, a year plus of the pandemic and political upset in at least in my country and in many places around the world, and just this feeling of that, that the whole world is not what it should be. Anyway. Um, not that life was easy before, but there seems to be a lot of languishing going around. So the article said that the the appropriate cure, so to speak, I can't remember the exact word, but what you do when you feel like you're languishing is you try to get into a flow. And you recognize that feeling. It's that moment where you're so absorbed in a task that you forget to check your cell phone for messages. <laughs> you're so absorbed, the time goes by. That's flow when you get really into it. Some, and people experience that in all kinds of um, of different ways. I used to do, I used to dance. And I remember this one moment in particular where I was dancing in a situation where I didn't feel completely comfortable. Like I, the musician was changing things up at the last minute. But somehow I was able to get into the flow and it was awesome. It was one of those moments that, I was completely present in that moment in every way. So athletes experience that a lot. Academics often I'll get into like preparing a homily or studying something that I'm interested in. And whoa, I am just so absorbed the hours. So that's flow. Thank you for listening. And let's uh, begin our prayer in the name of Abba, our creator, Jesus, our liberator and the Spirit who is holy. Amen. Holy Spirit, thank you for being present with us. The Ruach, the breath of God, always with us. Thank you. And we invite you to, to join us, to help us to become more present to you, to recognize you more often. And I know that all of this is putting all kinds of anthropomorphisms onto a Holy Spirit who is by definition indescribable. So thank you for your patience with that, my dear Lord. And so we invite you to come, breathe on us and in us and through us. And um, here we go. So friend, I invite you to take a series of five breaths with me. If you're comfortable with that, if not, again, the idea is to come back to uh, being in this moment. 
So you can choose if your breath is truly uncomfortable like last week with the sinus infection and post nasal drip was just so awful. It was very uncomfortable. So uh, my favorite alternative is to concentrate on the feeling of my fingers opening and closing. Partly because I can time that with my breath. Some people like to focus just on the feeling of their palms resting gently together, right? What does that feel like? Where are your feet? Where are your hands? You don't have to move them, just notice. Like, to help us come back to now. So, here we go. Let's take that series of deep breaths. So the first two are just going to be breathing, and for the last three, I'm going to add a, a prayer of blessing for you and for the world and for myself that we all receive the Holy Spirit's grace to return to the flow, to get into the flow of things, be able to focus and find joy and meaning in what we do and how we live. So let's begin. Holy Spirit, breathe on us now. Come, Holy Spirit, and fill us with your power and energy. Come, Holy Spirit, and clear out the clutter. Thank you, my friend, for joining me for this brief coffee break prayer. And may you be blessed this day and every day in the name of Abba, our Creator, Jesus, our Liberator, and the Spirit who is holy. Amen. And again, if you've been feeling not quite yourself, you and half the population of the entire world. So don't worry. Um, check out the link below and take good care. Bye.